Hey, Big Lines, Tyler Northrup here from Rosignol. Uh, what I'm holding here is the Super 7. Uh, it's the same ski that we've had last year. It comes in a, in a 188 and a 195. It has two sheets of metal in it, so it's stiffer. So the difference between this and the original S7, if you're familiar with that ski, is that uh, it's a lot more stable when you're running fast. So it's a ski for harder charging. It comes in one longer length than our original S7. Um, Built for a high-speed skier that needs to land cliffs, um, wants to ski fast, needs a really stable ski. It has uh, reverse camber in the tip and reverse camber in the tail and then regular camber under the foot. So what that does is uh, makes it so the tip is impossible to dive when you're in deep snow. Um, the camber underfoot is 18-meter uh, turn radius. Um, you can carve it. Uh, like you uh, live in Europe and wear tight pants, but then when it's it's deep out, um, you get another, um, I'd say 10 centimeters worth of ski that's actually in contact with the snow, and you can handle anything. You're going to want to upsize this a little bit, maybe 10 centimeters from what you're used to with a traditional camber ski, and uh, can be used as an everyday ski. A lot of people just ride this exclusively on um, groom days, on powder days, backcountry, everywhere. Killer ski. Perfect for the FKS 180 binding. It's a nice lightweight binding, high spring, and it holds you down to the ski with a really tight roll coupling, so there's not a lot of play laterally with your boot. Um, perfect matchup for the Super 7.